know, it's a really interesting question because those four seniors were sophomores when we started in the American Athletic Conference and the, the lessons that they learned through their uh, final three years were just dramatic. But as I tell people all the time, they don't let us keep them any longer than four years. So we knew they were gonna be gone. And I think we had great uh, depth a year ago. And we're hoping that that depth now shows itself um, in a different role. Um, Cheyenne Creighton, I think, is going to anchor the post for us along with our newcomer, Asia Jones. I've always said Cheyenne Creighton was a third starting post player off the bench last year as a sophomore. Just had a tremendous sophomore year. Um, and then I think it's, it's going to be by committee on the wings. We've got a returning starter with Loisha Morris, Taylor Williams, who's been an off and on starter throughout her entire career at, at various positions, very versatile and uh, Bria Elmore. I think that's going to be who we're going to rely on to take the reins as a leadership group and also as a group of players that has that experience. Uh, the main thing for me, especially from Asiana Fuqua Bay and Brianna Wright, um, I really looked up to them. We all play the same position and so they really pushed me in practice and things like that. So for me, I learned how to compete harder. Um, due to the fact that, you know, we all challenge each other every day. The mindset this year is probably, you know, finding ourselves and seeing, you know, who's gonna do what. Um, last year we kind of had an idea because we didn't, no one graduated my freshman year, so it was the same team returning, so we kind of had an idea of like who was gonna do what. Uh, this year it's basically, you know, seeing where, who, like who's gonna fit in what roles and then seeing like, you know, getting wins from there. One, I think our, our chemistry has to be really good. I think our, when you graduate four seniors, chemistry and leadership completely change. And so I've really challenged them um, to, to be leaders and to be players that can manage the locker room and, and, and manage the attitude of the team and the work habits of the team. And so I think that's gonna be the thing that, that uh, is gonna make the difference for our team. But on top of that, we know it's also about production and performance. And they're, I think they're anxious for the challenge. That's going to be what they've dreamed about um, while they've kind of been in the second seat. Now they're in the first seat. My expectation of what they always are, we're gonna finish in the top tier of this conference and go to postseason play. And that doesn't matter what year it is, who's on our team, we're the University of Memphis and those are our goals.